Fisher started the 1957-58 US Championship with a modest 2-1 score then went on a 8-1 half-1-1 half spree that won the tournament. Some of his games were marred by shocking tactical lapses, including double question mark moves by both players. But his slips were offset by this game, which won the second brilliancy prize. E2 E4 C7 C5 Knight G1 F3 D7 D6 D2 D4 C5 takes on D4 Knight F3 takes on D4 Knight G8 F6 Knight B1 C3 A7 A6 Bishop F1 C4 E7 E6 Castling King side B7 B5 Bishop c4 b3 b5 b4 For a brief time in the 1950s this retreat, with nd2 c4 in mind was a major alternative to knight c3 a4 which can expose the knight to attack from bd7, qa5. Knight c3 b1. In his first book, Fisher said he didn't believe Soviet analysis that claimed White had enough compensation after. Knight f6 captures e4. Queen d1 f3. Bishop c8 b7. And he gave. Bishop b3 a4. Knight b8 d7. Bishop a4 c6. Bishop b7 captures c6. Knight d4 takes on c6. Queen d8 b6. Queen f3 takes on e4. d6 d5. As evidence. But the Russians suggested 12. Nd2 was better, but there haven't been enough practical tests to tell. Bishop c8 d7 Bishop c1 e3 Taking the pawn now is too dangerous Knight f6 captures e4 Queen d1 f3 d6 d5 C2 C4 Knight B8 C6 F2 F3 Black misses his best equalizing chance. Knight c6 a5. Bishop f8 e7. c2 c3. White now obtains the upper hand on the queenside 12. a5 13. nb5. qb8 13. a4. b4 takes on c3 knight d4 takes on c6 c3 takes on b2 
Black loses two queens and there he moves after. Knight c6 captures d8. b2 captures a1. Bishop e3 d4. Bishop d7 captures c6. Knight b1 captures c3. Castling king side. Rook a1 c1. Overlooking, or underestimating, white's combination. Better was. Bishop c6 b7. After which. Queen d1 d3. Rook a8 c8. Rook f1 d1. And na4 b6, or the immediate 16. na4, which offers white a slight pull. Queen d8 b8. Knight c3 d5. Black might have tried to hold the extra pawn after. Bishop c6 captures d5. e4 captures d5. However after the text Black has long term problems on the light squares as he would also have after. e6 e5. Rook c1 c6. a6 a5. Queen d1 e2. Queen b8 b4. Rook f1 c1 Queen b8 b5 Rook c6 b6 Queen b5 a5 Rook b6 b7 e4 captures d5 The same goes for Knight f6 captures d5 e4 captures d5. Bishop c6 b5. Which invites a terrific exchange offer. d5 captures e6. Bishop b5 captures f1. e6 captures f7. King g8 h8. Queen d1 captures f1. Followed by, bd5, rc6 and qc4. e6 takes on d5. Rook c1 captures c6. d5 captures e4. f3 takes on e4. If black had counted on. Knight f6 captures e4. When he chose his 15th or 16th move, he would have been disappointed now to see. Rook f1 takes on f7. Rook f8 captures f7. Bishop b3 captures f7. King g8 captures f7. Queen d1 d5. With a big edge. Queen d1 d5. Is refuted by. Knight e4 g5. 
Bishop e3 captures g5. Queen b8 a7. King g1 h1. Rook a8 f8. Queen b8 b5. Rook c6 b6. Queen b5 e5. Bishop e3 d4. Queen e5 captures e4. Rook f1 e1. Queen e5 takes on e4. Rook f1 e1. Queen e5 g5. Fisher has two flaws, Larry Evans wrote in 1963, overconfidence which causes him sometimes to forget that his opponents are also capable of finding good moves and impetuosity in winning positions. Here he allows an excellent maneuver that nearly equalizes. With Rook b6 b7 Black's straights are dire because Knight f6 takes on e4 Rook f1 e1 Costs material Rook a8 c8 Rook a8 c8 Rook e1 captures e4 Rook c8 c1 Rook b7 captures e7 Rook c1 captures d1 Bishop b3 takes on d1. d6 d5. Rook b7 captures e7. Queen g5 captures e7. Bishop b3 captures d5. Queen d1 f3 Knight f6 d7 Bishop b3 captures f7 King g8 h8 Rook b6 b7 Knight d7 e5. It's fine for black. Rook b6 b7. Knight d7 e5. Queen f3 e2. Bishop e7 f6. Black threatens 24. Nf3 plus 25.qx f3 bx d4 plus with good drawing chances due to the bishops of opposite color. King g1 h1 a6 a5 Bishop b3 d5 Rook a8 c8 White had threatened 26. Bx e5 dx e5 27. Rx f7 or 26 Qx e5 27. Rb5 Bishop d4 c3 Black would love to drum up kingside play with Knight e5 g4 But he has nothing to show for the pawn after Bishop c3 d2 Queen g5 h4 h2 h3 Knight g4 e5 
Bishop d2 captures a5. a5 a4. Rook b7 a7. Knight e5 g4. Fischer took barely a minute to reject. Bishop c3 captures f6. Knight g4 captures f6. Rook a7 captures a4. Knight f6 captures d5. e4 captures d5. Queen g5 captures d5. Rook a4 a7. Rook c8 e8. But... Bishop c3 d2 was a worth alternative especially since rook c8 c2 allows rook a7 takes on f7 rook f8 takes on f7 queen e2 b5 and wins knight e5 g4 rook a7 captures a4 Bishop f6 takes on c3. b2 captures c3. Rook c8 captures c3. Rook f1 captures f7. Y2 exclamation points. Isn't 30. Rx f7 31.ra8 plus obvious. Yes, but white's combination runs much deeper. He say that 30. Qx d5, which ends discovered checks and threatened. RC1 plus is refuted by 31.RXF8 plus KXF8 32.QF1 plus QD733.RA8 KE734.RA7 plus Rook F1 takes on F7 Y2 exclamation points Isn't 30 RXF7 31.RA8 plus obvious Yes, but White's combination runs much deeper He say that 30 QXD5, which ends discovered checks and threatened, RC1 plus is refuted by 31.RXF8 plus KXF8 32.QF1 plus QD733.RA8 KE734.RA7 plus But White's main point is revealed after H7H5 Which seems to win Queen e2 b2 King g8 h7 Queen b2 captures c3 Rook f8 captures f7 Bishop d5 captures f7 Queen g5 f4 Bishop f7 g8 King h7 h8 Queen e2 f1 King g8 h7 Rook f7 takes on f8 
Rook c3 c1. Bishop d5 g8. King h7 h6. Bishop g8 c4. Knight g4 e3. Rook f7 f3. King g8 h7. Rook f3 takes on c3. Queen g5 e5. Queen g5 d2. Knight g4 f2. King h1 g1. Knight f2 h3. King g1 h1. Knight h3 f2. Nevertheless, there is a white win, even though he must play a queen and pawn endgame after. Rook f7 captures f8. King g8 takes on f8. Queen e2 f1. Knight g4 f6. Rook a4 c4. Rook c3 captures c4. Queen f1 captures c4. Knight f6 takes on d5. e4 captures d5. Rook f7 f1. King g8 h7. Rook f1 captures f8. Rook c3 c1. Rook f8 f1. Queen g5 f4. Rook f1 captures f7. Y2 exclamation points. Isn't 30. Rx f7 31.ra8 plus obvious. Yes, but white's combination runs much deeper. He say that 30. Qxd5, which ends discovered checks and threatened. Rc1 plus is refuted by 31.rx f8 plus kx f8 32.qf1 plus. Qd7 33.ra8 ke7 34.ra7 plus. Rook c3 c1. Rook c3 c1. The retreat is the difference between winning and losing. Rook f7 f1. King g8 h8. Rook a4 a8. Rook f8 captures a8. Bishop d5 takes on a8. Queen g5 f4. Queen e2 f1. Now this move lacks bite. But on. Rook c1 captures f1. Rook f7 captures f1. Rook f8 f7. Rook a4 a8. And black has no luft and is mated. Queen g5 d8. Rook a8 captures d8. h7 h5. Queen f1 captures c1.
equally hopeless was. Queen g5 captures c1. Rook f7 f1. Queen g5 h4. Rook f7 captures f8. King g8 h7. h2 h3. Queen h4 g3. h3 captures g4. h5 h4. Bishop d5 e6.